Hello everyone, so today we're going to deal with some of the vehicle settings in Call of Duty Mobile uh, Battle Royale for Battle Royale in Bluestacks 5. With the recent update there has been some little bit uh, difficulties with the vehicle control, so yeah, here this in this video I will show how to fix them. So yeah, first of all, uh, if you have actually used my Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale layout, then uh, there are a few things that you need to do before proceeding uh, to the next section of this video. So yeah, just go ahead and click on the keyboard icon on the right side of Bluestacks and set, make sure to set the opposite in the middle, select my Battle Royale layout, which is Battle Royale Edited. And after that, click on the Open Advanced Editor. So after you have clicked on Open Advanced Editor on the left hand side, you can see there is this up and down. So you're going to remove them. Let's remove the up and Make sure to drag the down outside and then click on cross. It's just hard to find a cross. And then after that on the right side you can see there is left and right button too. Just remove them. Now click on save and yeah, uh, just close the control editor. So yeah, uh, one of my one of the person in my comments told me how to actually fix this. So yeah, we don't require those those um, up down arrows. So just go ahead and open your game, Call of Duty Mobile, and then on the right side you can see these three lines. Just click there and after that click on settings now on the left hand side you can see this menu just go ahead and click on video uh, vehicle settings once and if this happens just click on cancel and then again click on vehicle settings once so after that this menu will pop up so you can see there's uh there is this vehicle on the top and then there is uh tank controls on the down so just make sure to select the layout b for vehicle and also the tank control layout b they are by default selected uh, on layout A, just so let's go ahead and change them to layout B. Once you have made sure both of them are on layout B, just go ahead and click on custom layout in vehicle settings. And after that, just make sure to uh, see if that everything is like in their original position. Now click on the open advanced editor on Bluestacks again. And then now you can see there are some bike controls that uh, that does, does not really have any keys yet. So yeah, the, after you have selected layout B, it can be controlled with WASD itself. So we don't really need any more direction keys for the bike. But yeah, we need to set some keys to this um, vehicle controls of the, of the bike. So we, we are just going to put their num1 and num3 with, for the uh, bike. I don't know what is it they're called, but yeah, just, just put them. Yeah. And yeah, that should be it probably for the bike, I guess. There are some few bunch, bunch of more settings over here. So we're going to deal with the top one. I, it, it might be acceleration or it might be brakes. I'm not so sure. But yeah, on the uh, left hand side, you can see this is a flare. This is for the helicopter. So we're going to set the flare for the helicopter over here. And let's see which button might be good. For now, most of my buttons are equipped already, so let's see. Y, maybe? Uh, I guess Y might be good. I'm just trying to see that there is caps lock too. We, we could have used caps lock, but yeah. You, you guys can change the location of Y and caps lock if you want. Just drag them to each other's location if you want. But yeah, I will, I will be setting the flare location to Y. Um, just so just to be safe for now and then after on the top you can see there is this acceleration or brake maybe so just go ahead and uh, put the put the key for there but yeah our space is already there so no, not space not space nope so I think I can go with X yeah so let's put X over there and let's see uh, how it will go so yeah you can confirm the settings uh, if they work or not later in the game but yeah but it should work it should pretty much work and I, I do believe that the WST will also work. Yeah, but uh, the thing with the middle mouse click there, it's, it's just a little bit weird. So I say go ahead and just put one more middle mouse click there. Just left click and click on middle mouse and then it will be there. So after you make sure that everything is all right and okay. Yeah, middle click will be your ping, just so you know. Yeah. So just go ahead and save and now click the control that's editor. After you make sure everything's okay, click on confirm. And after that, uh, we are going to go ahead and uh, customize the tank settings now. Just click on there. And then you can see that the WST is a little bit off of the controls but yeah it's fine it, it's still going to work now you can see on the right side there is this uh, smoke light thingy but it might be the fire button but the fire button is way over to the left side so I don't know maybe maybe it might be a little bit tricky <laughs> I don't know so yeah just to be safe we are going to put another button in that fiery clouds thingy so we are going to uh, go ahead and click on our open advanced editor again of the blue stacks and then we are going to set the F key in there so if, if your shooting button does not really work with your mouse uh, while you're controlling a tank just go ahead and click on F and uh, F should actually go ahead and shoot your tank. So just go ahead and click on save again and then click on controls editor. So after that, click on confirm. Uh, after you make sure that everything is all right and okay, just to be safe. And yeah, uh, regarding the opacity, like some people are saying there are too many keys on the screen. So you can just go ahead and reduce the opacity on the top side. You know, you can just have to 
like if you completely reduce them you uh, you will not see any keys all right and believe me smart controls has even more keys than what i am using right now <laughs> it's just not feasible that's why people don't know about it so some people are complaining that there are too many keys on the screen so just go ahead and reduce the opacity and yeah if you want if you if you want you can like put it just like this just like mine it's it's still fine all right so just go ahead and click on confirm now after after you make sure everything's okay but yeah we we noticed that there was no helicopter controls of the going up and down so we're going to deal with that you actually have to lift up the helicopter once so it gets airborne so yeah just go ahead and click on open adversity to regain on blue stacks after you have clicked the keyboard like icon and then come over here and then uh, right above the X you know like um, above the X and below the X that I have set their key so you just click with your left mouse button there once and then set your num 8 on the top and num 2 on the bottom so it, they are actually the helicopters airborne and also getting landing to the ground button so if you press num 8 it will go up in the air and if you press num two it will get down on the ground so that's how you can control your helicopters first you gotta get them airborne and then you can co just control them with your wsd i have checked it and uh, if you put it right over there uh, and put the num two over there it should actually work yep uh if, if it doesn't work you can remove a uh, little bit like change their positions uh, make them go a little up or down you know if it doesn't work for you but yeah believe me it works for, it worked for me so yeah, that should be it probably for the video uh, regarding the um, vehicle controls your tanks should be working for quite fine your uh, helicopters also should be working fine and also so your bike and car so just go ahead test them out and yeah if people want to actually just uh, not deal with all of this and just want to install the controls directly then I will leave the link for the download of this um, battle royale layout itself yeah I'll just name it like battle royale plus vehicle settings all right BR plus vehicle so that way you can also just go ahead and use my layout like that I should have probably said it in the beginning, but yeah, just so you know, it's uh, uh, okay. Yeah, you can go ahead and download that. All right, I will see you guys later then.